hello beautiful guys welcome back to my youtube channel pet heaven so in this video i'm going to tell you about marhor and all the details that are related to marhor and also i used a lot of images to acknowledge you about these things so let's get started in the first part we have the introduction so the marhor is a large species of wild goat that is native to mountains of central asia these animals are known for their striking appearance with long spiral horns that can grow up to 1.5 meters in length. In this video, we'll explore the life habits and cultural significance of Marco. So, the life of Marco. Marco are social animals that live in herds of between two to nine. They are all well adapted to mountainous environment with large hooves that help them to climb steep slopes and rough terrain. Marco are herbivores feeding on a variety of plants such as grasses, shrubs, and trees. They are able to survive in areas with limited vegetation and can go for long periods without water. Marco breed during the winter months, with females giving birth to a single kid after a gestation period of around 150 days. The young Marco are born with a thick coat of fur which protects them from the cold mountain weather. They are able to stand and walk within hours of birth. The habitat of Marcos. Marcos are found in a variety of mountainous environment from the rocky hillsides of Pakistan and Afghanistan to high altitude forests of Tajikistan and Uzbekistan. They are well adapted to these environments and are able to survive in the area where other animals would struggle to find food and water. In some regions such as uh, Chatural district of Pakistan, Marcos are still hunted for their meat and horns. However, in recent years, there has been a concrete effort to protect Marhor population with the creation of natural park and other protected areas. Part 3. The Cultural Significance of Marhor Marhor have played an important role in the cultures and tradition of many mountainous wheeling peoples for thousands of years. They were seen as a symbol of strength and resilience, and other often used in religious and cultural ceremonies. In some regions such as Honza Valley in northern Pakistan, Marcos are still hunted as a part of traditional festivals and celebrations. However, in recent years there has been growing awareness of need to protect Marcos population and many communities are now working to promote sustainable tourism and conservation efforts. So at last we have the conclusion. So the Marco is a fascinating and highly adapted animal that has played an important role in the cultures and traditions of many mountain dwelling peoples for thousands of years. These animals are well suited to life in rock mountains environments and are able to survive in area where few other animals can thrive whether as a symbol of strength and resilience, a source of food and a home or as a focal point for conservation and sustainable tourism efforts, the Marhor continues to capture the imagination of people around the world. So thank you guys, this was my video today, stay tuned for another beautiful video.